standby video, standby audio, standby lighting. We are recording in five, four, three. Hello everybody, Colin and Riley here at the Charleston Gilliard Center and today we are setting the stage with our friend David. Hey everybody. So David, what do you do here at the center? I'm the head lighting technician. What are you gonna show us today, David? I'm here today to talk about one of our stage lighting fixtures called an ellipsoidal. An ellipsoidal is very unique compared to an ordinary lamp like you have in your home. First, let's talk about the source of light, the light bulb. As you can see, their appearances are very different. The household light bulb has a rounded shape and is frosted in appearance. This is so they can light up a large area like your living room. Generally, they are anywhere from 20 to 100 watts. Wattage is a term we use to measure electrical power. The higher the wattage, the brighter the light. The light bulbs we use in theater we call lamps. They have a very different shape, are transparent, and have thicker glass. Oftentimes they can be 550 watts to 750 watts, or sometimes even more. This is so they can be used to produce a beam of light that illuminates a specific area of the stage. They are also much more powerful than your lights at home. Many times the light you have in your home has a lampshade. This reflects the light up and down and is usually translucent. This means it allows light to partially pass through. This all helps to light a large area like your living room. Remember in theater we use ellipsoidals to focus on a specific area, correct? These ellipsoidals have reflectors that help us do that. It reflects all of the light coming from the lamp forward towards the lens so that you end up with a spot of light. Another thing that makes theatrical ellipsoidals unique is the shutter barrel and the lens tube. The shutter barrel contains metal plates that allow us to shape the beam of light. The lens tube focuses the light into a nice tight beam to light a specific area. That's much more interesting than your average house lamp. Look out for those beams of light coming from the ellipsoidals up here in the performance hall. Now you know that spot of light is made of a super strong lamp cut with shutters, shining off reflectors, and beaming through a lens tube. Thanks David for showing us that cool piece of lighting equipment. And thank you all for joining us, setting the stage here at the Gilliard Center. See you next time. High five. Good girl.